Motive matters. Motive matters. In the Old Testament, we just obey the rules. In the New Testament, motive matters. If we want this for the wrong reason, uh -huh. That's it. then we're sabotaging our own search. Right? But if we do what Brother Morgan just said, if we understand that it's all about his government, him being in control, and we want it to happen so that his name is glorified, not so we become notorious. Amen? Amen. I think motive matters a great deal. One Sunday morning, there was a lady in our service. I didn't even know her. She had had a stroke. She was paralyzed. And so she knew a lady in our church, and she had started coming to our prayer group on Friday morning. She wasn't, she had never been to our church. So she got, had a stroke and they started going and praying for her and she was paralyzed and the prayer group went one morning to see her in the hospital and they got there just as the technicians were showing her video of what the remainder of her life in a wheelchair was, was going to be like. So they sat with her, they prayed. She came home from the hospital. She wanted to come to church then. Her husband, of course, had never been and so he started bringing her. He came with her. He had to pick her up out of the car. It's like a baby. Set her in the wheelchair, wheel her in, go through service. He'd wheel her out, put her back in the car. She didn't have the Holy Ghost, never been baptized, whole thing. And one Sunday morning, just while somebody was singing, a young man in our church started weeping and walked back to the back to her wheelchair that was sitting behind the last pew. And, my, and, and like Brother Morgan said, my heart sunk. I thought, oh, no, don't do this. 